In this video I'm showing how to resolve an error with Windows Remote Desktop Services. I'll go ahead and click on connect here just to show the specific error in question. The text of it is, an authentication error has occurred, the function requested is not supported, and then it gives the IP address of the remote computer. I started getting this error after a recent batch of Windows updates, and I found a page from Microsoft that confirms that they ran an update that affects this CRED SSP authentication provider that is apparently used by Windows Remote Desktop Services. As for resolving this issue, you have a couple different options. The recommended one is to just make sure that both your local computer that you're remoting from, as well as the remote computer, are up to date on the Windows updates. But if running the updates isn't an option, or if you're in a rush and you just need to get this fixed, there is a quick group policy modification that you can make to get remote desktop services working again. And I'm going to go ahead and show how to do that now. I'll go ahead and close out of the remote desktop windows here for now. All you have to do is click on the little start button in the bottom left and then in the search field type in gpedit.msc and hit enter. This will open the local group policy editor window. I'm going to go ahead and expand the left hand navigation here just to make it easier to see. And what we want to do is under computer configuration open up administrative templates and then system and then credential delegation. And over on the right hand side here you'll see this option for encryption oracle remediation. Just go ahead and double click on that. Click enabled. And then for protection level, select vulnerable. Click on OK and then close. And now if I go back into my remote desktop services here and click on connect and type my password in and go ahead and accept. You can see that I was able to successfully remote to the remote machine. So that's it for this video. Hit the like button if this was helpful and thanks for viewing.